Well, guess what's happening out there, guys? The market is changing. And what does that mean for you? Well, here it is. There's gonna be more opportunities for new and future business. You're asking where? Where's the new future business? Around the expired listings. Because one thing we're starting to note around the country is auction clearance rates are dropping down and also days on market are starting to expand. So if you're looking for a new way to get business, think about expired listings. Now, everything in life is a science. There's a science. You wanna lose weight, Tom? You get a plan, or a diet plan, should I say. You get, a, you get basically a program, you might get a trainer, and you might go and train, for example, four or five days a week. And what happens after 90 days? Boom! You lose that weight, you look fit, and you look good. The same thing can be said about expired listings. There is a science about how to convert more expired listings in your marketplace. Now remember first off, the expired listing is not exactly gonna be really happy because that first agent has done one thing wrong. They haven't met their expectations. So when people don't have, you have unmet expectations, what do they do? They label you and they label you and go, all agents are the same. Here is your opportunity to be a little bit different and start to create a little bit of rapport a little bit early on. You see, most agents start attacking expires on day 90. What you wanna do is get in a little bit early. I'm thinking about day 50 and maybe do a market wrap up for the area and send it generically to that particular property and perhaps a few of the neighbors so they feel like it's a general mail out that you're doing. You don't want to be doing a specific letter. Remember, they're an exclusive agreement and there's got to be a bit of honor among thieves, right? We don't want to like just go and badger other agents, etc. But you do want to start opening the lines of knowing who you are and what you do. So day 50, send a market wrap up letter. Then about 14 days later, which is about day 64, I would send out of all the listings in the area. What are the listings that have recently come up? And just do a one pager with all the listings in that suburb, perhaps like a neighborhood report. Then day 76, this is where we come in for the kill. Do, 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 do. And guess what happens? We send the expired letter, which is direct mail. Because day 76, so you're saying, Claudio, but it's 90 days to an expired listing. Let's get one thing straight. They're only monitoring once the property goes live. Now, the photography, the sign of the agency agreement would have been done two weeks before that. So if you do two weeks, that's 14 days, plus 76 days, that's 90 days. So day 76, once you see it on the market for 76 days, guess what? It's an expired listing. That gives you the opportunity to perhaps send a letter and then follow it up with a door knock or a call. Now, once you do that, you've got to have a really good script. So you've got to have questions that are going to flow. Most agents turn up and go, knock, knock, knock. Hi Tom, this is Claudio. Um, look, we're working with some buyers, just wondering if we may be able to introduce some buyers through to your home. You know what? Every agent uses the same script. You wanna be the purple cow in your marketplace. So ask different questions. What could the questions be? Hi Tom, just updating my record. Just wanted to see if you're any closer to getting sold. No, we're not. Oh, where were you planning on moving to? How soon did you wanna be there? What do you feel may have stopped your home from selling? Is your home currently in an agency agreement? We've discovered there are four reasons why homes aren't selling in Smithville. I was just wondering if you'd be open to the opportunity for you and I to perhaps sit down and work out which one of those reasons is stopping your home from being sold. Guys and gals, it's all about asking questions. Once you ask really good questions, it flows, but you need to know what you're gonna say. So is there a process of being a rock star around expires. Yes, there is, and there's a science. Just like losing weight, having a wonderful marriage, everything is a science in life. But you've got to do the right things in order to get the results that you want.